What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. And as you can see, I got another unboxing video for y'all. Today, I'll be unboxing a Mac 11. Also, with some CO2 for my other airsoft guns. So, other than that, let's hop straight into the video. Alright, if you're wondering where I got my airsoft from, right here, printed on the tape, airsoft mega store. Other than that, I'm gonna open it. So we got some CO2 right here. I'm going to show y'all how much CO2 I got left in my uh, other box I ordered off of Amazon real quick. Alright, so I ordered this off of Amazon, I'm going to say a year ago, because I started ordering some green gas guns and I was mainly using that. So it comes with 40 in here. I started ordering some more CO2 guns and I started using all my other CO2 ones. So I have... Hard to see, but I got three left. So that three with this twelve is definitely gonna go good. I'm gonna get some more. I'm definitely order that forty off of Amazon again. But moving on to the airsoft, the Mac Eleven. All right, with the box open, you're gonna get this. Now the Mac Eleven is uh, what says gas and CO two powered. When I was looking online, it just said CO two. So that's a good thing, but I'm take this off, and oh my god, comes with BBs. This I have no idea what this is for yet. The L key that we need. Okay, so this is the mag. Oh god, it's heavy. This is the mag. As you can see, the CO two goes at the bottom. So if it's also gas powered, where would that go? I don't know. But I do this with one hand. Whoa, heavy, bro. This right here is the gun itself. Try to see if I can do this. Oh, that's that in the frame. That's what you can hear. So, this is the Mac 11. I'm going to put some CO2 in here and shoot it for y'all. But I don't know if y'all saw right there. Semi-auto. If y'all can see it. Right there. So, I'm guessing full auto is where? I don't know. But, also, on this side... If y'all can see it, it says safety and fire. I know it's hard to see. But I could just slide it. If I want it on safe, then I slide it up. If I want it on fire. But I'm ready to shoot this. This is beautiful, man. I'm glad I got this. So I'm going to go ahead and put some CO2 in here. Alright, before I shoot the airsoft... I have no idea what this piece is for. I was looking at the manual, but I didn't see what that's for. And I'm guessing that front piece is supposed to stay on there. As I was reading the manual, I saw that this piece is on there. It doesn't really bother me except for the sound, but other than that's all right. Also, I got some CO2 in here, and I also put some BBs in there. This is halfway filled, so I'm going to go ahead and shoot it for y'all. I gotta do this with one hand. Actually, I'm gonna put the camera down. All right, earlier when I showed y'all the semi-auto, if you turn this, it says full auto right there. I know it's hard because of the light. But as y'all can see, full auto right there. At first I was looking for it, then I was, as I was reading the manual, I saw it right here. You just gotta turn it. I guess I wasn't really turning it. But also, uh. I forgot what this is called. This could come out. This button at the bottom. If you hold it in. Slide it out. This part does get stuck up here a little bit. Um, but. Like I said. Doing this with one hand. Hold on. Alright. Once you take it all the way out. This is what it's going to look like. I kind of like it like this. It's not bad. Uh, but yeah. Let me know what y'all think about it. With it out. Also. Before I shoot it. 
um, on here, it says the uh, G12 series. Y'all let me know if it's called that or the Mac 11 or Mac 10, whatever you want to call it. But uh, for this video, I am going to call it the uh, Mac 11. But y'all let me know if it's called the G12 series. But other than that, I'm going to shoot it right now. Stop wasting time. As y'all can see, it's on semi-auto. It's also on fire. It's hard to see. And the uh, slide is back. It's hard to see the BB in there. But I'm going to shoot it for y'all. I don't know if you can see this part slide back as you shoot it. Let me see. It's hard to get this. Oh, it does slide back. And um, I think this also closes too as you shoot it. I'm going to just shoot it with my offhand for y'all try to get it on camera. I think it does. But... I'm gonna shoot it a few more times on semi auto that I'm gonna switch to full auto for y'all. But so far on semi auto, I like it, man. I'm gonna go ahead and slide this uh, piece back in a little bit. But I hope that I run out of CO2 already, bro. Let me go ahead and switch it to uh, full auto for y'all. Ran out of CO2 already? Yep. Alright. See, that's the only downfall about the CO2. I look, it'd be running out fast. But I'm gonna go ahead and switch it for y'all. Load some more BBs in here for y'all. Then I'm gonna shoot it on full auto again. Alright, full auto. I reloaded the clip with some more BBs. So here we go. Ready? I gotta add more CO2. Alright, I'm about to test something out. I just put some more BBs in here. Now, as I heard, it sounded like the CO2, you know, uh, it sounded like I needed to change the CO2. So I went ahead and loaded some more BBs in here. I put it on semi auto. I didn't change the CO2 yet, but I want to see if it's empty. So it, it's empty. So. I gotta change it already, but that's two already, yo. Y'all let me know if I'm doing something wrong with these CO2s or they just go out like that. See, no wonder why I try to buy as much green gas airsoft as I can, but I like to also have some CO2 versions, but right here, man, I'm already about to be on my third uh, CO2 cartridge, so... Yeah, let me know if I'm doing something wrong. Um, I think I'm going to load this up again and shoot it one more time for y'all and give y'all my final thoughts on this airsoft gun. Alright, to end it off, I have a full clip for y'all. I'm going to go ahead and shoot it on semi-auto first, then I'm going to switch to full auto. Semi-auto. Now I'm going to switch to Fado. Alright, I put Fado on. I also brought this out. I forgot what it's called. But Fado right here. And I ran out again. Alright, my final thoughts on the Mac 11. It is a great airsoft gun in my opinion. Except for the uh, CO2 running out fast. But what do you expect with a Fado airsoft gun like this? Yeah, let me know what y'all think about it. Also, if I could put a trace unit on here, please comment down below which one I could put on here. And I'm in the video right here. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm out.